guys, if you are thinking, even considering selling your bread route, do it. <laughs> and don't, and don't, don't, don't think that Sara Lee is going to be there to help you along the way. Anyway, like I was saying, if you are thinking about selling your bread route and you are with Thomas, uh, Sara Lee Taki Bimbo Bakeries USA, it's, it's, it's such a long process. Alright, so if you're thinking about selling it quick, it's not going to be like that. I personally talk from experience, I got a buyer, which would took forever to find a buyer that was qualified. <laughs> that was qualified and met all the requirements. For some reason, it took me forever to get a buyer. But I have a buyer. I've been having, um, we are in this process of selling this route to him. For four months. Four months. Tell me why in the world would it take four months to get everything together to be able to sell and transfer my rights to this person. Okay, I've shown them the business aspect of what the business and what the bread route runs. What it has, the sales averages um, weekly monthly and quarterly and I showed him the yearly statements of what I made he was good I was good I agreed to sell him the route at a price and possibly included the truck I told him if nothing else um, I would let I would let the person you run uh, use my truck as long as this insurance covered it in case of anything happened while he, while he um transitioning to him either finding the truck or he could t uh, buy my truck <laughs> but regardless we can't get past the phase where bimbo actually closed closed we closed on the sales route it's been going on for four months so if you're thinking about selling your bread route just know it's not a fast process not a fast process at all it's it's from the i mean it's all the simple stuff everything on my end has been turned in to um the whatever their positions are called the uh territory managers or whatever they're called now everything has been turned into them my buyer has gotten approved through um through the banks that Bimbo uses, which is the only thing I think they're the only ones that can they can finance it. Either you have the cash to buy the route, or you have to use them, which is Bimbo uses Advanta first. Such a long process. I mean, we're going on four months. For one, my buyer, I took forever for my buyer to receive an application for him to fill out. He filled that out. And we're at a phase where everything else has to be, uh, he got approved about, uh, about a month ago, he got approved. And now we're at the phase where everything else, I guess, has to get checked out. You got to get all the people in place. But I mean, in the meantime, if you, if, if you don't, if you don't stay on top of your buyer, you're gonna lose the buyer. There's a high, there's a good chance that you lose the buyer just because the process takes so long. I mean, my buyer is ready to take the route. He's I'm really ready to sell it four months ago, five months ago. I've been ready to sell, and we're here. We are at August thirty first, and I mean, just everything pops up. The guy that was handling the sale of my route got sick and <laughs> I mean I don't blame him but I feel like it's thing after thing he got sick they transferred it to another guy to finish the sell, sell the route and he never got all the information from the other guy 
to be able to complete. So then we had to resubmit all the documents to him. And now he's pretty much, I mean, he's a whole lot better at communicating. Because the other guy, the other manager was horrible at, at answering his phone call, answering the phone calls and getting you all the information that you needed, the documents, getting you in contact with whoever. He was horrible. This guy at least picks up the phone and uh, lets you know. And I'm still, I'm like, where, where are we sitting? When is the closing date? Where are we standing on this? <sighs> he signed at least three more, three or four more weeks. I swear, I'm, I'm going to be lucky if this guy doesn't just bail on me. I'm talking about my buyer. Because we're going on for five months. It's probably, if if what he's saying is right. Five months is when we'll be closing. Why? There's no need. It, there's no need for this to take five months. When has when has any process? I mean, this is slower than what the government runs at. So if you're thinking about buying the room, buying a room, you, you better make sure that this is exactly what you want. I've owned this route for about. I think I'm going, I want to say seven, eight years. And I'm ready to sell it. I'm ready to sell this route. If Bimbo doesn't move this process along, I don't know how other companies are. I don't know how other companies are ran. But Bimbo, you have to find a better way of selling this route. Flowers might be eat, might be a lot faster. Martin might be faster. It, it could just be my my area. I mean my state. It could just be that this this state just takes forever. But I tell you, the way my prop, the way the way it is in my area, and all the other IOs that I've talked to, all the other independent operators that I've talked to. They've said the same thing. That the process is, takes way too long. I mean, when you buy a house, you can pretty much close within 30 days, 45 days. That's expected. 30 days. Okay, you expect that. But you don't expect to take half a year, <laughs> almost half a year, to, to sell, a, sell a route. You could lose a buyer by that time. And then trying to find another person that's interested in a route in your area that, that, that qualifies or meets the requirements. It's not easy. It's not easy. You don't, you can't just find another buyer around the corner. I mean, not everybody has the money, the down payment, the credit to run a bread route. And most people don't even want to do this. Nobody wants to wake up at 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock in the morning, get the bread, run to the store and deliver it. I, mean, I don't know. So, Bimbo, please, if you're seeing this video, do something about the process. It shouldn't take four, six months to close on the bread route. So, anybody that's thinking about buying a bread route, make sure this is something that you actually want to do. Hmm. It's a good, it's, I mean, bread route's a good investment. You're really, you're going to be working a lot, but your return is, I mean, pretty good for the most part. As long as you know what you're doing, you're ordering, you're ordering enough bread, enough bagels. I, put, I brought some of these, some of our uh, comments, maybe some of our products. This is all that I have in, at the house. Well, not the house, you know. Just here with us. I love this bread. The Arno Italian bread. Good stuff. But just gonna make sure this is it. This is what you want. Because when it comes to selling the bread route, you don't want to be worried waiting on half a year to sell it. That's all I got. Watch the video. Like the video. Any questions that you might have, let me know. It could be that every uh, this this is just my area, and all the and all the IOs that I've talked to just had this kind of experience when selling their bread route. 
but I'm pretty sure this is just across the board. This is how fast Bimbo runs and how they're not in a they're not in a rush to sell the bridge, sell the route. They gotta buy it. They gotta somebody run the run the route. So they're not in a rush. It doesn't benefit them in any way, uh getting another buyer on it. It's be a different thing if this is a company route. Company run ran route. And where they're the ones actually having to do this. I'm pretty sure if that's the case, they move the route a lot faster in terms of trying to get the route sold. So if you're buying a route from a company, you're more than likely probably going to get uh, get through, get uh, get approved, get get the process moving a whole lot quicker. you probably be able to get that done in about two, two, two months. And that's what I'm. That's what I'm guessing. But if you're buying it from another IO, where the where the where Bimbo Bakery don't do, doesn't have any need to rush it along, they're not gonna do it. That's just my perspective. That's just what I what I what I've seen and what I think is uh, it's going on. So yeah, if you're saying you had a a great experience with with buying a bra from Bimbo, it's because you probably bought it from a company. Bought it from them and not a Exactly, uh, I.O. who's already running the round. But nonetheless, after all that, <laughs> like I said, watch the video, like, comment, anything you want to know. I appreciate it. See you in the next one. Bye.